Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. My name is Jay God, and in today's video we're going to take a look at what Obsidian Camo what looks like in way? game. I was able to jump in right after the update, look through the various challenges which we'll kind of go through just so you kind of have a heads up which camo challenges are going to be easier. And then I went for the easiest one possible, grinded it out so we could see what it actually looks like in game. Because if you look at it in the menu, you're going to see it's not very appealing. And what we can see here is the one that I ended up going for was the launcher camo because all you got to do is shoot down 100 kill streaks and that was pretty easy just jump in on a match of ground war shoot everything out of the sky if i end up in a lobby with somebody else doing the same thing i'd leave the lobby and jump back into a new one and that's pretty much the method i used and that's what we're going to see right here i ended up getting it over here on the pila and you can see how it looks on the table um, as far as the rest of the challenges go each of the weapon categories has a different set of camo challenges right here for the rifles you can see that you need to kill 15 enemies in a match 200 times and what we found out already is that these actually stack so if you manage to get 15 kills with the gun you're going to get one if you manage to get 30 in a single match with this individual gun you're going to end up getting two counting so if you ended up going off and you had 150 kills with gun kills only that would count as 10 matches as far as the progress bar i'm not sure if this is intentional or something this is that they're going to patching so it makes it significantly harder to unlock so i would try to jump on your favorite weapon as quick as possible and grind out those kills especially since we have shoot the ship back into the rotation so now when we go to the other various weapons if i go to the smgs we can see that the smg camouflage challenge is 15 kills but only for 150 matches so 50 50 less matches that you need to do that in still holds true with this you get 45 kills it's gonna stack and count as three individual matches this is the first time we've seen this with challenges a lot of the other ones that we have to do to unlock weapons you literally have to go through each individual match so this is a good change in my opinion if it stays this way obviously if it's a bug try to knock it out as soon as possible same thing when we go over here and we can look at the camouflage in game you really can't even see really what it looks like in game but this one right here same thing as the smgs the shotguns and then we'll move on to the next weapon lmgs you can see for lmgs they kind of kept it in line with what we've already seen same thing i ended up only doing two matches with this thing and then i decided to just go for launchers i was like no it's not really worth it but you can see right there i managed to get four out of 150 without actually playing those four matches so that one's there and then we'll move on to the next weapon category marksman rifles which you can see here we go to camouflage and this one you need 125 so a little bit less than we've seen in the other previous categories this kind of goes in line with the actual camo grind challenges these ones are by far the easiest compared to the rifles you need 800 kills compared to 600 or 400 in some of the weapons so this can be considerably faster um, comparison it just depends on how good you are with the weapon you might not be getting as many kills so they've made it a little bit more attainable for the average player you just kind of got to grind out the matches uh, next one sniper rifles this should be similar um 125 same exact thing and they've kept the camo's challenges simple so you don't really have to think about it for the riot shield um what you got to do is do 750 kills total and it doesn't matter how often you get them i think they didn't want to make this one too much of a stretch goal because having to get more than maybe 10 a match would be a little extreme for the average player um so let's go ahead and go over here to the secondaries so when we go to the secondaries handguns 100 matches um 15 kills isn't that hard i would jump into hardcore if you're going to knock those out if you want obsidian pistols or you at least want one of them you got to grind those out and something i didn't mention is the prerequisite is you have to have gold on the weapon doesn't matter if you have platinum for the weapon category and odds are for your favorite weapon at least that weapon you probably have gold so that's the one you'll probably want to work on first uh next weapon category is the launchers and like i already mentioned all you need to do is destroy vehicles and kill streaks 100 times and as you can see right there it's already been completed 100 out of 100. uh next up is going to be the melee weapon which is a little bit different than you would think. You think that would be in line with the riot shield, uh, but they've changed it up for us, and you got to get 10 kills 125 times. So again, if you get 30 kills, that's going to count as three matches, as long as they were all with the knife. So now let's go ahead and jump into a private match so you can see what the camel looks like. So you can see what it looks like on the back. It, personally, I didn't really like it, um, and as we'll jump into the match, I'm going to look at it at different angles. Um, obviously, different weapons will probably have a little bit of different look for it. All right, so now that we're in a match, you can kind of see what it looks like personally i feel like it's it's void of all color we're gonna get into a different lighting so you can kind of see what it's all about uh personally i think it's ugly ugly trash um i probably wouldn't grind this for half of the weapons i might do a video on um maybe a couple of them um just to have them in the thumbnail but other than that look at how 
it's just horrible i don't know what they were thinking it's not animated it doesn't it's not vibrant obviously we know what obsidian is supposed to look like and this looks relatively close to obsidian um so i don't know what exactly i was expecting but this just seems kind of lame for a mastery camo that you're grinding out for um i'm gonna go ahead and shoot this oop i'm gonna go ahead and shoot it so you can kind of see how it reload and they'll have a little bit of a little thing in there so you can see it really quick even the actual uh missile that you put in there the rocket actually has a little different thing there but other than that this is uh kind of lame in my opinion let me know what you guys think of it down in the comments section if you did enjoy the video in any way make sure you hit the like button if you're brand new looking to find your way back for whatever reason make sure you are subscribed with notifications on i do appreciate all the support thank you for watching as always have a great day